it's a good day to get stuff done, so that's what I'm gonna do. Did you make your very own toast for this? Yeah, person? put it in! See what's in the dining room? That was the dumbest movie I've ever seen. Ah, yo! Ah, yo! Ah, yo! Good morning, everybody. So, Matt Good and Skylar. Good morning! Aspen's yelling from the dining room. Good morning! So Matt and Skylar are off. Skylar had a job today, so he went. He uh, took Jacob with him, of course, because Jacob always helps him talk this morning. And Braxton went with just to make sure Matt wasn't sitting in the car by himself and stuff like that. He's doing much, much better today. He was still pretty sore last night because we traveled into Dubuque, so kind of took a lot out of him to do that. And he's not supposed to sit for more than an hour at a time than he needs to get up and walk, she said, just uh, to make sure that he's not having any issues with blood clots. So. But it is supposed to be, I was going to ride with him, but it's actually supposed to be stormy possible severe thunderstorms here. So I didn't want the kids here with tea with that kind of weather. So, and they did not want to drive with us today. So I'm here at home. And since it's a stormy Saturday, it's a good day to get stuff done. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to spend the day just getting the house back in order. It's been so crazy busy with the surgery and just kind of getting things ready for that that the house needs some TLC. So I wanna get some floor mopping done, stuff like that. Um, I'd like to get the front porch cleaned off today because it really, really needs it. But with the weather the way it is, I don't know if that's gonna happen. And I wanna clean the bird's nests out now that the birds are gone. So we'll see what we get done today. But yes, today is a stormy Saturday clean, I guess. So might as well clean with me. All right, Mr. Aspen, you wanna tell everybody hi now? What are you doing on the stormy Saturday? He's lost in YouTube, you guys. I'm not sure. What are you watching? <laughs> All right, if you know what it is, guys, let me know because he's not talking. He is enthralled with what he's watching. What are you watching? Um, uh, a car crash for and then the police like trying to catch him. Because he accidentally bonked it, tried to get that butterfly that was on him, but then he bonked him. Oh my goodness. Both time putting this in there, but now we just have to stop, like, I'm feeling... Has to toast. Don't I mean, mess with it. I'm just feeling the temperature. So, did you make your very own toast for this? Yeah, person? put it in. You put it in and, and then you I push pushed it. this. Yeah, you pushed it down. And now we might need Don't to unplug it when it's done. When it's all done, you can unplug it. I'm gonna check these things. The spices. Did you hold the plate? It's a lot of butter, sir. Okay, so I just had to take water pri playing privileges away from one of the children because I have a rule it gets played with at the kitchen set and that rule got broken. So the consequence was a natural consequence. It, I, whenever I try to give a consequence out in the house, I try to make it fit whatever was going on. And so the natural consequence is you lose playing with the water. So I now have a mess to clean up on the carpet. Thankfully, it's just water, but I'm trying to avoid walking on it. And it's not on our living room carpet, thank goodness. It's on the dining room carpet, which the dining room car carpet is probably, I'm gonna try to shampoo it, but it's, oh, this fly is driving me crazy right now because of the weather we've been having. Flies are just ridiculous. I've been having to go through the house and smack a bunch of flies. Anyway, I'm gonna try shampooing the dining room carpet and then we'll see. It may end up needing to be replaced anyway. It's had a lot of wear and tear. I've probably had it for, I'd say at least three years. So, and being in the dining room, it's taken a lot of damage in there with spills from people eating and stuff like that. So we'll see. I've done some stain treating and just some like basic cleaning on it, but I'm gonna actually try to do like a good shampoo on it and see if I can't bring it back to its former glory. Otherwise, it's gonna end up going bye-bye. Anyway, 
I finally pulled my hair up, I tried to put my contacts in because I'm actually supposed to be wearing my contacts on a regular basis, not my glasses. And when I put one, put them in this morning, I couldn't see out of the right contact. So I'm in the glasses again today and it looks like I'm gonna have to order some new contacts. I'm gonna get started on the dishes and get this Saturday kicked off. watching a movie I've been waiting to see and I promised T that we'd watch some Netflix today. So we're watching um, A Christmas Prince. What's the other movie we're going to watch tonight? How It Ends. So that one's not something I can watch with the littler kids but it did look really good. It's like one of those uh, like a seismic activity or something happens and something goes on with the world. So I'm pretty excited to watch that one later tonight. But right now we're going to watch Christmas Prince. Okay, so I'm a crazy mess. It's been humid and sticky and my hair is showing it today. But I gotta show you what we have in the dining room right now. So this is the beginning of what will be coming tomorrow, but we did not have a vehicle big enough to move it. See what's in the dining room? New chairs. I'm so excited. Okay. So the reason I have new chairs in here is because our friend Carrie is actually giving us her family table that she had for her family. It was her mom and dad's and then she had it and now she's sending it our way. So I'm really excited. It'll be coming tomorrow. It is a beautiful table. I cannot wait to show you guys. And there's even a little history behind the table that I'll ask her if I can share with you too. So. I'm just super excited because it's coming tomorrow. We're gonna have a new dining room table and I cannot wait. I gotta show you what we've been living with. And it was a free table, so I'm not gonna complain. One of the neighbor ladies had it to give away free and it's worked for our family um, for the last, probably, I'd say since last summer. So maybe it was early in the spring. I can't remember when we got it, but it's worked for us for a while. So, but I'll show you what we've been dealing with. So this, if you haven't noticed before, is my dining room table. It's got all these like wear and stuff. It's not real wood, it's kind of like this, I don't know, this press board wood. And it was really old, it was a hand-me-down from one of the neighbors, so. But it got us through, but I cannot wait to show you the new table tomorrow. All right, and I'm about to tackle the second round of kitchen cleanup. It's not too bad, there's some chips on the counter and a few dishes, and I'm gonna put this stuff away. There's a little bit of stuff out of place some pans on the stove. We did BLTs tonight, but not too bad. So, and then I think T and I are gonna watch a movie again. How are you liking the new chairs? Mm, yummy, yummy. They're yummy? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so sad. <laughs> They're nice. All right, I have to show you one of the coolest things about our house is we have pocket doors. So T and I are about to watch a movie. What are we watching? How It Ends. How It Ends, yes. And the kids are out there playing games in the dining room and we can shut the pocket doors and have it like a movie, movie theater, theater in here. It's so nice. It's nice. Okay. So T and I just finished our movie. 
That was the dumbest movie I've ever seen. Like, it had Forrest Whitaker in it, and I love Forrest Whitaker. I think he's such a great actor. That was the dumbest movie I've ever seen. It had the worst, I won't tell you, but there's no spoiling it anyway. If you see it, I know you're gonna agree with me. It had the worst ending ever. Worst ending ever, no. Wicker Man had a pretty bad ending too, but I think this was the worst ending ever in a movie. Okay, T, am I being really mean saying this was a horrible no, movie? No, that was a horrible movie. <laughs> it really had the worst ending ever, didn't it? It ended and I was like, what? Was so <laughs> what? Surprising. I didn't even tell you what happened. Huh? 